Why did my Medicare supplement plan increase in July? Hi, my name is Robert Bache. I own Senior Healthcare Direct, Medicare Bob's Office. My agents and I, we assist people nationwide with their Medicare supplement, Medicare Advantage, and Part D coverage. A popular question I'm getting right now on our Facebook page is, why is my Medicare supplement premium increasing in July if I can't make a change to my supplement plan until the annual enrollment period, which is October 15th through December 7th? It's a very popular question. It doesn't seem fair. If you can't change your supplement plan to October, then why are the insurance companies raising your premiums all year long? Well, here's a secret that you may not know about. It's not really supposed to be a secret, but apparently not everybody knows this. You are allowed to shop your Medicare supplement plan all year long. That's right. There is not a designated time period to shop your Medigap, your Medicare supplement plan F, G, or N. You are allowed to shop it all year. So why is there so much confusion around this? Well, the annual election period is October 15th through December 7th, and it's called annual election period or annual enrollment period, AEP. Well, that is October 15th through December 7th. This is the only time of the year that you can shop for your Medicare Part D coverage, or if you have a Medicare Advantage plan. That's the time period you have to select your plan for the following year. But a lot of people get confused about it and they lump in Medicare Supplement Medigap coverage with those other two types of plans and coverages and they think that's the only time they can shop their coverage. But that's not the case. You are allowed to shop your Medicare Supplement plan all year long. In fact, in some states there are even special rules that allow you to shop your supplement plan and not have to medically qualify to go to a different supplement plan to save money. A couple of examples. In the state of Missouri, they have what's called the policy anniversary rule. So every year, 60 days before and 30 days after your effective date of your Medicare supplement policy, you're allowed to shop your Medigap plan and go from either the same plan to another plan or lesser plan with a different carrier to save money and you don't have to medically qualify. In fact, Oregon and California have what we call the birthday rule. So 60 days before and 30 days after your birthday in Oregon and California, you're allowed to shop your supplement plan, and again, those carriers cannot make you medically qualify. But even if you live in a state that doesn't have a state-specific rule, you are allowed to shop your Medigap supplement plan all year long. So, there's no reason to overpay for your insurance. If you follow me on YouTube or Facebook, or you go to our website, you know that the letter of the plan determines the coverage, not the carrier. So a Mutual of Omaha Medicare Supplement Plan G offers the same benefits as a Cigna Medicare Supplement Plan G. The only thing that's different is what you pay for it each month. That's right. Your doctor will take both Plan Gs the same. The benefits are exactly the same, paid out exactly the same. Go to any doctor, any hospital, it's going to pay the hospital bills the 20%. If you have the G, all you pay is that very small Part B deductible. So, there's no reason to overpay. If you like the G, let's help you get the best price for it. If you like the Medicare supplement plan in, let's help you get the best price for it. If it goes up $10, $15, $20, that's money that you could use toward your drug coverage or your drug plan or a dental plan or vision. You can use that money for something else. Because remember, you do have to medically qualify to change. So when you get a rate increase, don't just kick the can down the road and say, well, it's only $15. Maybe I'll shop next year or maybe I'll wait till October. You can do that, but you're taking a risk because if your health changes, you may not be able to switch your carrier because every carrier requires you to have a two year stability of health in order to switch plans. And uh, you can't have any chronic conditions like hepatitis or cancer in the last two years or emphysema with oxygen. There's certain rules. Now our agents and I, we represent every single carrier. And the rules are a little bit different. They mostly ask the same 15 to 20 questions, but some of the carriers are more lenient on diabetes, for example, than others. So what's cool about Senior Healthcare Direct, Medicare Bob's office, is you represent everybody. So based on your needs, we can help you get the best price that you're eligible for. But my big message here is even if you don't work with us, call your agent, call your broker, although if they're doing a good job, they should be emailing you when you get a rate increase or calling you. That's what we do. Um, but shop your plan. There's just no reason to overpay. There's so many things that are increasing in price right now and Social Security is not really 
increasing as fast as everything else. So don't just complain about that stuff. Control what you can control, which is get the best price for your supplement plan, and my office will be happy to help you. Our phone number is gonna be in this video, and I'll drop a link to our website where you can put, fill out the information, and uh, we'll follow up with you and give you a side-by-side -side comparison of who you have now and what you're paying, and we'll give you all the best prices for every single carrier for the plan that you want. Thanks, and have a great day.